uh, contemporary art, I think, well, for many years, has been constantly searching for valid subjects, testing the boundaries of what it is supposed to represent since the invention of recording instruments like the camera and cinematography and so forth. Those functions uh, uh, were abandoned in, 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 a, in a way by painters and sculptors. But I find myself feeling that there's a crisis in, uh, I cannot accept illusionism without criticizing it somehow within. In the film Color Sound Frames, there is an image of a film strip, a linear film strip going by, or moving in, the, in this uh, screen space. You actually see the strip on the screen? No, it's a representation. Um, it looks like you're seeing as if something's uh, been, uh, the projector has been kind of opened up and, and you're seeing more of the film than you're supposed to be seeing. Now, I guess that's one way of... I mean, the sprocket holes the sprocket on the sprocket holes and, and so on. The however, this... Strip. Yeah, however, this is not true. I mean, this is, uh, this is the effect and uh, it's an, quite an intended effect, but it's an image. It was, it's as much an image in a sense as... Uh, an image of a table or something. It's not really the film strip in the projector. It's a film of a film. It's a film of a film. And I think that's rather important. Well, stream section, um, there, are, there are six words. They were chosen for certain sound qualities they had and a certain lack of meaning in relationship to the film. I didn't want them to be connected meaningfully to the film and they were superimposed in such a way to finally generate a certain effect. So that the, where they overlap, it doesn't make any difference. I mean, they go through many phasing kinds of changes, and it doesn't matter to me because I know that I know that if I do it at all, certain effects will emerge. See, chance, if you have two two or three things moving in relationship to each other let's say by chance and they're cycling around you can tell well there's going to be emergent effects that are going to happen every so often and you can you know how often they're going to happen so if you want them to happen a lot then you make your system tight and simple so that there's more possibility for frequency and apply probability theories equations to this but you can also just figure it out, you know, just figure it out. Like Cage wants to let things happen by themselves. I don't. I use it because it's a way of generating what I want to happen. And that's what I did in stream section. I knew exactly what I would have to do to get what I wanted.